I need some birds pitching by my doorstep. Does that calm you down? No! Can't wait to decorate. There's so much we can make. How will it turn out? OMG, we're coming over. Open up, we're here. Okay, you're yelling like so loud. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys. Welcome to our first OMG Wacko back. 2017. 2017. I have new hair. That's beautiful, by the way. You're oh, beautiful. thank you. I hope you guys like it. I this like is a it. really big deal, you guys. So be nice in the comments, please, because I haven't changed my hair in like 12 years. Thumbs up for Kate's hair. Today we are getting super woman. -ish. That's right, Lily Singh. <gasps> oh my god. I'm like so excited about this. I have admired her for years. It's seriously thrilling. We are going to do two rooms, you guys, but we're only gonna do one for this episode. The first room we're doing is her bedroom. She hasn't decorated at all, and this is her first house she's ever owned. It's a big honor and a lot of pressure. And then you'll have to tune back in next week, so make sure you subscribe so you know when that's coming out. And then you also have to go over to Lily's channel and check out her amazing video where her parents try their hand at decorating. Make sure and subscribe. <laughs> We're yes. so close to that Mr. Kate 1 million where we're giving one lucky subscriber that $10,000 room transformation. Yes! And also a thousand bucks for every 100,000 subscribers goes to charities that help those in need find housing. Yes. Here we go. Let's get super with it. What up everyone, it's your girl, Super Woman, and sometimes I go by Lily. Yeah. See right now when we're shooting outside and it's really cold, so I'm gonna take a shot. I have super long hair. I'm a unicorn. I have a YouTube channal called youtube.com slash II Superwoman II. And I just bought a new house and I'm obsessed with Mr. Kate. What you're looking at right now is the luckiest person on the planet because I get not one but two rooms done by Mr. Kate. And in my opinion, these are the two most important rooms, my bedroom and my office where I spend most of my time. I'm a big believer that you are a product of your environment. You have to be around positive vibes, which is why I'm so smiley. I'm also she has done so many amazing things with herself and her business and her channel. I'm excited and I'm also feeling the pressure because she is so fabulous, so I have to make sure that these rooms are as fabulous as she is. This is the first house I've owned ever in my life that is my own, and so I've never had the ability to be like, I'm gonna do this to this wall. I'm gonna knock this down. I'm gonna nail this into the wall. I've always had to ask permission, so I'm super excited to make this space my own. Also, extremely terrified, so I'm kind of freaking out, man. Wow. My queen now. You got it. I know, I sleep on the floor. I'm an adult. That's so great that you got a king bed though. I know, I've never, I've never had a king bed in my life. She has a bed, she has a TV, and she has a suitcase. I don't have a bed frame. But that's not your vibe, sleeping on the floor. You want a bed frame. Yeah, 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 that's not my vibe. Um, I have a TV, it's on this weird stand because my last apartment didn't have a place to put a TV on a wall. My old apartment, I had one TV, but two rooms, so I was like, why do you need two TVs? Just get a rolling TV. Wait, what? Right? How many times did you actually roll it between rooms? You know, none. <laughs> none. This is how I've been living for like a month because since I've moved, I've been so busy and I've been craving to have a functional space. Is it disastrous? Is it workable? I don't know. It's so workable. I mean, your place is gorgeous. I love the floors, high ceilings. I love this window. But right now, I don't have blinds, so people see my boobs. I changed it for this window. I need blinds. I feel like thus far in my life, I've been very like simple. Not anything's wrong with being simple, but I'm like, I need a mirror. Let me go get any mirror. I just yeah. always choose function. No, I think design. a lot of people are like, that yeah. it's like I need what I need when I need yeah, it exactly, as opposed exactly. to coming at a room with like a Hence the rolling of, TV. Yeah. yeah. When we originally talked, you were like no color, <laughs> like it's my bedroom. I set you up to like find some mood board images and you came back with Yeah, I did. I came back with lots of colors. Originally she was thinking that she didn't want to do a lot of color in her bedroom because she thought, oh, that's where I want to kind of escape from color and have it be more neutral. But then all of the pictures that she sent me were so colorful and color blocked. She just said, these just feel really good to me. I was like scared to commit to the fact that it was my place. And then I finally got over my fear with the mood boards and I was like, let's just make it my dream bedroom. Yeah. I mean, I know you're around so much color all the time, but there's a way to make color peaceful and happy. And I think that's what I don't know how to do. Colors really excite me. Like I freak out over colors. Okay, good. Well, come yeah. check this out. Okay, okay. First things first, 
Let's paint these walls. Okay, let's take oh these. Oh my god, I'm too I'm a nerd. I'm the biggest nerd in the world right now. Joey, do you have plans for I, that? This just feels like one of those like washboards. I'm kind of in like a country mood. Or we could just like drop the beat because Lily's got a little rhyme going. Uh, no, let's take this thing, cut it off. Let's take this thing, cut it off. Get into this kid like bam. Like bam, give me that food timer. Hey! Put it, put it in the hole! Open, 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 open! And it's pink. Okay, now this pink is like beautiful, you guys. This is a deep, sophisticated pink. I'm so impacted by color. Color makes me feel warm and fuzzy inside. I see this beautiful pink. It is literally the color of my soul. If that excited her, she's gonna have her mind blown today. This is such a pretty color! Yeah. I don't have to pick favorites so I don't want to hurt the other color's feelings. Oh, I get that. To, I totally get that. It would be this one. The pink color was the perfect combination of like my unicorn side and the fact that like I'm obviously a mature adult. It was like a mature unicorn pink. Why this excites me so much is because I used to live with my parents. Yeah. Right? I mean, you know, I had no choice, don't judge me. But I had to live with my parents. And I always wanted to paint my room red when I was younger because I always had a white room. I had to beg my parents, like, till this day, they no, remind me of the really? time they let me paint my room red. Oh my god, look at me, I'm painting! <laughs> so I'm thinking there's rules I gotta follow, but Joey's like, why don't you do something underneath the layer of paint? And I'm like, oh. Obviously, so I wrote L and an S underneath the paint, which so like for the rest of my life I know there's my initials under the wall. Oh, I'm so smart, I'm a genius. I don't think there's enough room for me in this here to do anything. Soul. Excuses! Mad excuses! <laughs> Cheers guys, I'm gonna go over oh. the wall. Cheers. Cheers. Bye! So Joey two rolls, of course, he's got this. We're gonna leave him because painting is a lot fun. I mean it's fun to show the color, but then I wanna go do arts and crafts. This looks so crafty, doesn't it? Yes. But I'm bringing you options okay. for the area by your doorway. I don't remember the last time I did anything artsy by myself. She has this great idea, which is creating this whiteboard frame. I wanted you to have a piece of art there because it's just a blank yeah. wall, but then the door kind of opens, so we right. can't have anything too big. Right. So I know that you love text yes. and words, yes. right? They mean a lot to yes. you. And you guys know I like to do a personalized piece of art that's gonna go into the room. I was brainstorming different things to do, and I know that she's very motivated and inspired by words. We'll take a frame, white piece of paper. I was thinking, it could say something along the lines of like, today I will be. Have that just at the top, yeah. and then we'll frame that with a glass over it. You can write on it with whiteboard. You're so smart. Do you like that? Today I will create. <gasps> yes! You guys know I love the word create and creative. Shout out to my creative weirdos. Do oh, Joey! Are you making a bagel? Do I get included in that like whole friend thing? <laughs> Lily and Kate are like having best friend Sashes. I love you up here to paint. I have no friends. I'm gonna eat a bagel. We can either do like a brush pen, so it's kind of more hand done. Then we have these stickers okay. that we can lay out. And then I also found these letters that are wood, which we could either use the wood color or we could paint them black. I think these are cool. I think these are cool too. Because you know, decor is 360 and three dimensional. <laughs> You're such a good student. You know. We are going to paint these letters black, which I think is cool. It'll just make them stand out more than the natural wood. We'll just glue them down, making sure to leave a good white space. And then, of course, you can just fill in the blank every day. I'm gonna do a paint break. Oh, yeah. Real quick, right now. The message what will I create? And then you also created this piece of art. Good. <laughs> is projecting a line onto the wall? Yeah. I walk into the room and there's this like Mission Impossible laser thing. Your best Beyonce, right? Beyonce. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. How do you get any work done? I would just be so amused by this all day long. The biggest project in this room is the lyric wall. I haven't been able to sleep for the past several days because of this idea of having a lyrics wall in my bedroom. I emailed you a million yes. pictures because I just wanted you to see so good. all the mm -hmm. options. And then you literally, yeah. the spark. I had a eureka moment because right? you sent me this text and I've never seen this before. It was the complete wall was covered in text. Yeah. And I thought it would be really cool to have lyrics to one of my favorite songs, which is Three Little Birds. Because I have this thing where I have to have one Bob Marley or several Bob Marley elements in my home. So I'm like, Kate, what if we do the lyrics to the whole song handwritten? That should go on my wall. 
So we're gonna write the lyrics mm -hmm. to one of your favorite songs. Yes. That also has a message about waking up. And this is why I love to collaborate on these rooms. I wouldn't have thought of that. I didn't know she liked Bob Marley. And she needed to know that writing on the wall was possible and okay. I love Bob Marley. Do you? Love him. Oh I think Joey's like getting jealous of our friendship and I'm like, so you'd get used to it. Right. Sit by my doorstep. Yeah. So to do this lyric wall, we are using the laser level, which is pretty crucial because I don't want to have to draw any pencil lines. And it's really important to measure your wall so you know how big the spaces are going to be for your text. I'm going to write all of the words in pencil, and then we'll go over with black paint. It's not just going to be the there's ones. We're going to repeat it over and over again, right? Yes. Very good question. Do you like the little periods in between? I think each? I do, actually. It's a story we're telling throughout I the room. And then it'll carry your eye. Yeah. Like, oh! She is quoting me. She is very much on board with the lyric wall. She's like, cool, you write it. I'm so excited. Me too. OK. I'm glad you're excited because that's a good note to leave on because I want you to Am I going away? It's so now? sad because I really. What kind like, of friend are you? What are you in? You're hanging out? <laughs> trying to Don't what? What <laughs> kind of surprise artist are you? Yeah. I'm just trying to be a good friend. Really? Because now I'm going to leave. You two fight over me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let me know who wins. So they're kicking me out of the room, and I'm not really processing the fact that I'm going to leave, and when I come back, like, I'll have a room. I'm not really comprehending that whole fact. So when I come back, the room will be done? Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. Bye. 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 Lily, goodbye, go nap, and I'm just gonna write on your walls. I'm gonna do it in cursive lettering because she has a lot of block print and I just like the look of the cursive letters. It's a little bit more dreamy. And you think about a song, and especially this song in particular, it really does sound like he just kind of penned it on a lovely morning while the birds were singing. Curtain hanging time, where's my wash bin that I need so I can sing my country song? Hang these curtains all day long. Da -da 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 curtains, 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 curtains. Oh! What? Well, I'm trying to get this level. I can't use the tripod anymore because the tripod is too high up. This is my message to you. Don't worry. Everything's gonna be alright. I am worrying. I'm not listening to the lyrics right now. I need some birds pitching by my doorstep. Does that calm you down? No! Joey, I'm gonna break out my BB gun in a second. <laughs> I'm using a calligraphy brush, kind of a pointed tapered tip, and some glossy black paint so it really gets that hand-drawn look. Like, it looks like I used a calligraphy brush. Right now all she has is some recessed lights in this room, so we're gonna hook her up with a cool semi-flush mount, multi-tiered round light. Really give that hotel vibe when you walk in here, light up the whole room. It's just a very peaceful lamp. There's so much going on in this room with the color of the walls and the beautiful statement text that I didn't want a crazy light fixture competing with the text wall. Lily had a TV on what kind of looked like a thing you would have at like a dentist office. I'm gonna make this stationary and put it on the wall. TV Joey. Oh, drop. TV Joey. Lily's vibe is so colorful and modern, and so we had to really search high and low to find some really unique pieces for her. This vanity we have, it's gonna be a flip top vanity with a glass leg. This is not like something you just walk into a store and find. We like hunted for this thing. Got it? Oof. Yeah, it's heavy. And we are bringing in this vanity and it is so cool. It's a similar vanity to the one we put in Megan's room because it flips up and the mirror is underneath and basically becomes a desk. But the style is completely different because Lily's style is very modern. This one has really beautiful clean lines, a glossy white top and it has one side that's glass. You know yeah. what I love? What? Okay. So. Your favorite! For hours I'm just like, okay, they're doing my room. I hear banging, I hear things, I hear laughing. I'm just like, I don't know what's happening. I have no idea. I'm really excited, but I'm really nervous. Okay, yeah, this will be what? piggyback rug. Three. Piggyback uh, rug roll. It's that time. Roll out rug time. <laughs> Get on your knees. What do you mean? 
Get up on your knees. Keep going. I'm gonna get on Joey's back and he's gonna piggyback roll me, roll out the rug. She's my babe. She can ride on my back. I don't care. Uh. You got this. Oh, it's handmade. This rug was handmade. I'm reading the story about the rug while I'm riding Joey's piggyback and he's rolling out the rug. This rug has been certified as authentically handmade through our collaboration with the nonprofit. <laughs> 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 this rug is beautiful. It's like a purple velour kind of super soft under your feet. Oh, should we? Oh, okay. <clears throat> okay. No, no, no. God, it's like a small know. little package. I don't know why you always have to like make it so uncomfortable. Three little birds hitch by my doorstep. Oh, I saw a spot. We need to put the period. I'm really glad I'm studying this right now. Hey, Joey. Joey, we gotta bring in the headboard. And you know what that's gonna establish? Did you make me coffee? No, you don't need coffee. I need you to get a good night's sleep because we got the office to do tomorrow. <laughs> Lily had her bed on the floor, um, so we're gonna help her with that. The bed is really important. She has a king size mattress already, so we have to bring in a box spring. Oh, this is like a good, this is a, a good sweetest treatment. Yep. Good night. It's a king size box ring, but it comes in two different pieces. So Joey put it together, and then we are like laying down the slats, which are like, uh, what does Dracula sleep in? Coffin. I will sleep <sighs> when the sun goes down. Does Dracula talk like this? I have a room to decorate. I can't suck your blood tonight. I have a room to decorate. Wait, why is my head tilted up this high? Because you're lay down further. No, this is how the vampires sleep. <laughs> really important when you have a king size bed is to have a nice sized side table. You do not want a small bedside table next to a giant bed. Behind the bed, we're gonna put this really colorful tufted headboard that is bringing in a yellow tone, which is like I just love the color yellow, and so does Lily. It's just such a happy, fresh, bright color. It is the color of optimism. This dresser is amazing. It's a giant lock dresser. It's this sort of dark gray. It has this kind of slant on the drawers, and that's actually the handle. It's super modern. This is perfect because it really anchors her TV. But we're placing it a little asymmetrically because then we have this floor lamp. Very modern with a marble base, and then it just kind of arcs over, and then it's just a bulb. Cool contrast to the other lamps in the room that have shades. On top of the dresser, I'm styling some pinks and some yellow items and the coolest thing ever, a boom box candle. When I saw that at the store, I almost bought two of them, but I was like, I don't think she needs two boombox candles. Some succulents on the dresser and also with the bedside table. They're really cool. They're actually faux succulents, which is good because I know she's so busy. I don't want her to have any dead plants in her room. So these faux plants are the perfect solution. I'm also placing this yellow tray, which I like a tray by the bedside, especially on a bigger bedside table, because it just gives you a place to put your phone and it's plugged in at night. On top, we are putting these simple white lamps. They have the nice white shade, which we also have the white shade going on in the ceiling fixture above, so we've got the rule of three playing beautifully with those lamps. At the foot of the bed, I'm placing this beautiful violet bench. It has kind of the warmer wood tone that's happening on her doors and on her window frame. It's really nice to have to sit down on, to put your shoes on, your socks on. It's just actually functional and looks amazing. We've got a yellow lamp on the vanity. It's beautiful, it has sort of a see-through base so the light from the window can shine through. For the curtains, I went with a light gray linen and they have a blackout lining so that Lily can close those because I know she likes to sleep in because she stays up so late working so hard on all of her videos and editing and vlogging and just being a boss. This vanity's so cool, the top flips up and inside there's little divided compartments. I've also added some more clear dividers. Guys, this mirror, I think it's the biggest like floor length mirror I've ever seen. Like this thing is massive. The bedding is a dark linen duvet cover. I love using linen because it's super cozy. You can wash it a million times and it just gets softer with every wash. And I just like having that grounding color with all the other bright colors going on. And then of course we've got throw pillows on the bed. You guys know I love throw pillows. These multicolored ones and then some more blocks of color, the pinks and the purples. The stool for the vanity is this super cool yellow square on top. It's basically like an upside down pyramid on this silver base and it swivels. I just love color blocking throughout this room. So of course, we are repeating the pink, the yellow, and that little bit of purple. So all those colors make sense and are friends. By the door, we are putting our DIY artwork. The Today I Will Create art is the perfect art for By the Wall. And I'm also hanging up two clamps, which are the perfect little holders for some dry erase markers, so they are right on hand. And they also have little erasers attached to the tip of them, which is perfect, so she can just erase and write her new intention every day. Lily, come on in.
So the time has come for me to see my room and my body is not ready. I'd be lying if I said I didn't pee a little. I'm peeing a little bit, okay? I've literally performed in front of thousands of people and this is the most rest I've been ever. Really? Yes, I swear. <laughs> One, two, two, three. Holy crap! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> be my room. I am not fabulous enough for this room, but then Kate made me feel like I am fabulous enough for the room and I was like, ah, this is so pretty. Is that a candle? First thing I see is this amazing candle. Wait for it. Dramatic effect. Shaped as a boom box. What the heck? This is your new vanity. Oh. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Oh my God. Right? So then it's not obstructing. I'm gonna be cute. significantly hotter in life and it's hundred percent because of Kate. Yes. But that is so cool. Isn't it pretty? I always used to see these beds in like Google Images and I was like, okay, people that have those beds are fabulous. Wait, Wait does this does this function? Of what, course. Does what function? That <laughs> <laughs> and then look her. Am I, I'm so emotional right now. Okay, Sorry tell me how hear. I'm just seeing the dresser. I swear <laughs> to God, I did not see the dresser until right now. I know, there's so much to take in. Like, you there's the so sweat? many giant yeah. items here. How did you get it into my house? This like is why you need a Joey friend. Outfit. And the writing, like, just It looks so, so good. And then the wall, even, is, like, so good. And there's no spelling mistakes. And I'm like, she didn't even have autocorrect. Like, I didn't even get it. Looks like someone was thinking of a song. And yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. It's because cool. you'll Pop have art. the block text like yeah, yeah. elsewhere in your place. Speaking you know? of elsewhere in your place. Yeah, oh, good segue. We have got <laughs> a lot to do still. And the best part of this whole thing, I already paused for dramatic effect. They're doing my office tomorrow. We're going to start the office tomorrow. tonight. Yes. And we'll pick it up in the morning with you. You guys knew what to do it. <laughs> I'm so happy. Thank you oh so much. God, I'm so welcome. grateful. Thank you Thank so much. Yeah, thanks for having us. It's been a pleasure. Hey, we'll, we'll see, see you tomorrow. in like eight hours. Yeah, I'll see you <laughs> yeah. Get out my room, though. <laughs> <laughs> They're doing my office, and I'm so psyched for that because that's my professional space. I sell my personal space today. Tomorrow's my professional space. Who knows what kind of freaking boombox candles are going to be in the office? I have no idea. I'm freaking out. I'm going to my room. Peace. Such a colorful and such a cool room. I know, I'm so glad we got to do a colorful room for you guys. Some of you asking, like, stop with the neutrals, let's do some color. And of course, we only do what people ask us. We took the color out of your hair and put it into the space. <laughs> Too so Make sure if you're not subscribed, you want to check out that whole thing. You thought that was next level? Wait till you see the office. Yeah. And make sure you go over to Lily's channel. Subscribe. Do it! <laughs> do it. Do it. <laughs> we love you. Yes, love you so much. Thanks for hanging out. We will see you on the next video, which will be with Lily again, which I'm so excited. So we'll see you next week. Yay! Bye. 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 <sighs> I am getting tired. We're almost done with this wall. Look how cool this is gonna be. What time do we start tomorrow morning? Oh, that's the wake up alarm. Got it. What? I need to sleep for at least three hours. Okay, well, let's just, let's go to bed. Wait, are my armpit stained? No. Okay. No, I don't want to sleep here. Oh. I want to go home and shower. Okay, wake me up when you get back. Are you eating right now? All right, so here's what we're thinking. Bold colors, color blocking. Lots of color. Color, <laughs> color, 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 color. Color, little color. Nope. Lily hate color. And a beautiful vanity to organize all of your makeup products. Yeah, okay. Lily only know how to use one eyeshadow color. And a stunning accent.